A neighborhood rumor we first told you about back in September has come roaring back. Zach Merchant is live in Bonaire to separate fact from fiction. Yeah, Lori, we were out here about four months ago after a viewer got in touch with us saying there was some concern in the neighborhood that the House and County Board of Education had bought this property. We took a look at it then and it turned out they had not. But when we got another call from another viewer asking the same question this week, we wanted to take another look at it and this is what we found out. The school worries started for people on Thompson Mill Road back in the fall and a big concern was traffic. It is a mess. If you don't get out here every four, seven, seven o'clock, you're going to get traffic jam all the way. And though zoning notice had gone up on this largely empty property on Thompson Mill back then, House and County Board of Education spokesperson Beth McLaughlin told us in September the district was looking to build a new elementary school somewhere in Bonaire, but had not made a final selection on a site. The records that are now available appear to show they were at least close to selecting one. House and County Board of Education meeting minutes from August show unanimous approval for the purchase of what the agenda called Property B. Another set of meeting minutes from October 2nd show Property B's acreage and price were adjusted to 35.17 acres and $662,813. The exact same acreage and price, House and County Public Records, show the school district paid for a plot of land on Thompson Mill Road in November. So we can verify the school board does own this land. As for the traffic, House and County Director of Operations Robbie Dunbar said plans to widen the road were already in place before the district bought the property. He said the road from the intersection of Thompson Mill and Old Highway 96 to Southfield Plantation will be expanded from two lanes to three. It will cost between three and four million dollars, he said, but should relieve some of the traffic issues. And in an email we just got a little bit earlier this evening, about 45 minutes ago, Beth McLaughlin confirmed the House and County Board of Education does plan to build an elementary school here. She said as part of a plan to ease some of the overcrowding issues at other Bonaire elementaries. Live in House and County, Zach Merchant, 13 WMAZ News. Thank you, Zach. McLaughlin added that the district expects to begin construction this coming June and complete it by July of 2020.